But listen, like the David Oates thing, you know, he opens this thing up, but he's like retarded. He can't see half this shit. We can see. No, I'm telling you, the guy who's with the, you know, uh, you know, he was a runner up for a Nobel laureate for discovering reverse speech is always truthful. So you would think you might start going into other shit like God and all this other shit, right? History breaking down to the real makes basis sense. of reality. It makes sense that being that we know for sure with reverse speech, there's something mythical about this. It's that the words that we speak reverse that are that clear, impossible. Like when I say I love you, when it comes out to we shall die or, or, or God loves you, that's not supposed to fucking be like that. Do you understand me? I, I love you is not supposed to turn out to be we will die or we shall die when you say God loves you, God bless you. Do you understand me? This is not supposed to happen. Everybody's been praising God and all this shit for like forever. And you've been like sealing your own, you know, like you're, you're nailing yourself in your fucking coffin. Yeah. So you know, like the words of swords thing, I think we have visual confirmation and audible confirmation that this is real. That it's not only in language, it's that if you take a frequency like they say, they flew a satellite by Saturn, and they got the sound of Saturn. And when you play it backwards, you can see the video. It talks about Satan taking over the world or something like that. <laughs> Figure out what the reversal is. Then you do another one with the forward and the reversal together so you can play it back like a ping pong thing, you know? It's back and forth. You can hear it from... Mm -hmm. Just make sure you understand what I'm talking about. Nobody does this, not David Oates or anybody else. Like, what on. one person on. says... Oh, Make sure everybody understands it. All right, hold on. Yeah. Now, hold on. See, it's both ways. Look, look. See, it's, it's both. I see it. What the word is, reverse it. You know, most people just go back and forth to the same thing like this. You got to see it both ways and ping pong it back and forth like this. That's what confirmation is. That's how you could. I mean, that's a total confirmation. But some things you can't confirm, like, you might try and figure out specific shit but it only lets you, do you go think some things are meant for so i can say the same thing you said and it sounds completely different the way i said it do you you know that's right some people yeah. can't so. get unfold. there's something mythical behind this like they're definitely a creator there's, there's no way there's not a creator this whole language shit and magic with blood magic and stuff no we can see we can see the difference between us and the people who haven't spilt their blood. They're complete fucking retard. You know, when I say I own your soul already and shit like that, and all your leaders run the Bible, people can laugh this off. We're talking about sealed in blood, the atonement for your soul. It's not like somebody could overturn this shit. You hear all this reverse speech now. It's inescapable. When you see stuff like this where death shows up and, 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 and clearly tells you, uh, it's Monty Python with the whole. Remember, Monty Python had the Holy Grail and stuff, and then they also showed this other one with death. And death shows up and says very specific words. Uh, when they said, "This is Mr. Reaper," and uh, oh, I'm Satan, he said, "Say I'm I am Satan," is what he said. And it's sort of like what you see in that that Solomon Cain, where the devil steps up and says, "I am the devil's," you know. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm here to, to collect your soul on behalf of the devil. It's not like somebody can escape this shit. It's that your grandfather died, your grandma died, and all this other stuff. It's that we know that's natural order. Now you got this guy sitting over here telling you that's not natural order. There's a holy grail over there. When we reverse holy grails, layer below. So when you talk to them, like, like what you're saying, you hear people talking about ascend and stuff like that. We're descending. <laughs> We're becoming I real. You know, when people say you want to lighten up, you know, you're you're at a uh, you're at a it. too low of a vibratory state. I'm so fucking low in a vibratory yeah. state. I'm taking over the fucking. I'm real. I am. I am not scatterbrained. I am fucking so dense. You know what I mean? I am so you know together. It's like everybody's <laughs> so in reverse. They're talking about ascending. I'm talking about descending. It's that. It's that. Okay. In the tail on the donkey, like Don the Father is in heaven. It's that. It's the holy hole at the center of the dish, you know. It's the asshole they're showing you, the asshole. Why would it be pin the tail on the fucking donkey? Why would it be his fucking asshole? A pin in his fucking asshole. <laughs> so, you know, when I say, you, you know, marks this. <laughs> everybody with their vibrational shit and ascension shit, I never even ever say I, those words because it's a complete reverse of what we're talking about here. Corner. 
people will never get it. If a genie popped up in front of you, the last thing you'd be thinking to say is the shit I'd say. You'd be thinking billion dollar bullions is shit and gold and all kinds of shit. The last thing you'd be thinking was, I intend to bring forth heaven and earth releases over my get a little passing guard, baby, release you from your body. We got, yeah, I mean, you're all thinking about yourself. I'd be thinking about the genie who was stuck in a fucking bottle until I rubbed his ass out. <laughs> what, what, what about this poor guy? We're all in that bottle right now. You don't bonded. get it. We're in that fucking bottle now. Now the genie pops out, and you're going to ask for something selfish? No. I mean, that's just ridiculous. <laughs> understand it, overstand it, understand it. Any kind of standing. That would be nice. Any kind of standing. <laughs> I hear people, sure. look, you're not a cop, when I say I understand something, or, you know, you know, the whole, don't say I understand, I overstand you type stuff, you know, that's because, like, we were talking to an officer who's a public servant or something like this, I overstand you, no, I don't understand you, I overstand you, you know, type of thing, but when we're talking to people like us, you know, and, you know, people say they want their sovereignty and shit like this, and, and let's just get something straight, we want to be one as a whole people, there, if one individual doesn't have their sovereignty, you know, like here, what I'm trying to say is that it's supposed to be a one world type of thing. When they, when you hear them pushing this one world, new world order type government thing, this is like ridiculous. This is kind of funny. The Holy Grail, once you become a super being, there's no reason for government or anything. We're just all happy people. We have eternal life, you know. We, we know what the secret is. It's going to unfold. It's all like it's really unfolding like a prophecy. Like I said, you can pull out a, a book about this shit and start on reading it. You'll probably find some biblical shit. Mm-hmm. Anything, anything that talks about prophecy. Mm-hmm. What? Where's the prophecy written that says this is all going to happen? Has anybody found? They've been pushing this shit on TV for years. The Antichrist is going to rise up and take over the universe. It's prophecy, isn't that the fucking? It's called TV a lot nowadays. Nowadays, what is, the they devil. say it's prophecy. Where is it written? Tell me. Do you know? As a Bible, have you ever, look, you were once Jesus peeps at some point, you have a Bible, and they were pushing you, telling about the Antichrist and his prophecy. Show me where the prophecy is. Certain mm-hmm. words, you should already know what it is. Like when we say motherfucker, we know that's what we'll her offer them. You know what I mean? We've got certain words down, like, fuck you. We know his, wait, you know, certain things when we say, so now we have a list. We can make a, a dictionary book with all the reversals, word by word, through a dictionary. First letter in the dictionary, first word in the dictionary, you're, you decode it, but it's the code. Go to the next one. Of course, this would take a lot of people. It's a lot of words. But what I'm saying is that somebody should have done this between back when David Oates was talking about turning records backwards. People should have been figuring out what each word was backwards. Sort of like when I say we, it's you. You is mm-hmm. we. You know what I mean? It's, it's done. Back God is die backwards. You know what I mean? Uh, this yeah. is just this is important shit that people need to know. That's that's not those are no fucking accidents. Somebody who created these phonetic sounds had to be a mythical being because it works in every language. And you're not going to pull all that off in one lifetime if you live a hundred years. I, I assure you, that's a lot of languages to try and pull off in one lifetime without any electronics or something like that. Because in the past they didn't have apps and cell phones, did they? Yeah, no, no, the language has been around too long, way before we had apps and cell phones, supposedly. What I'm saying to you is that having these apps and cell phones are not an accident. Some One of my yeah. demons must have, like I said, everything's unfolding like a book. Those demons were around long before Satan was here, standing here as Satan. They've been sitting here cultivating everything behind the scenes. Everything that leads up the Fisher King, like Jesus has this thing where he had an empty thing with one fish in it, and then they fed the whole village and kept pulling out fish, right? Mm-hmm. It's a limited bucket of fish. You know, what I'm saying is that, and then it turns out the real Fisher King is not named Jesus, it's Braun, Barney the Brown, what the fuck is that? So, this is impossible shit. It's not, Satan's real name is Mark, this is not an accident.